Jimmy. So Jim Kirkland is <laughs> State Paleontologist of Utah. He's been focusing his research on the Cedar Mountain Formation, which is early Cretaceous and found all kinds of dinosaurs all along this tiny strip in central Utah. And some of the faunas that he has found are quite amazing, include animals like Utah Raptor. How many slides do you have? <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if he has one. Okay. Uh, some curious and others. Uh, the work that he's actually been doing is actually really important. Um, 20 years ago, we didn't think there were any dinosaurs from the early Cretaceous in North America. And the work that he's done and others really has led to our understanding of what's going on in that time period. Uh, some of the interesting things that happen is we go from a world, you think of the Jurassic as Cleveland Lloyd dinosaur quarry. You know, it's a world dominated by Allosaurus, Stegosaurus, some long necked sauropods. All of those animals really change in the next uh, 30 to 50 million years. Uh, tyrannosaurs are bit players in the world of the Cleveland Lloyd dinosaur quarry at 150 million years ago. And that Jurassic fauna is dominated by Allosaurus, by far the top predator. This continues through this section of rocks, but at the very end, the last Allosaurus relative goes extinct. And that is the moment in time when Tyrannosaurus can step in and change the world forever. Allosaurs and their relatives kept Tyrannosaurs as bit players in the ecosystem until they disappeared in North America. And then once that happened, it was all downhill from there. Um, <laughs> some of the other groups of dinosaurs that Jim works on are the armored dinosaurs. And just in this section of rocks, there's a huge amount of armored dinosaurs that we didn't know about before that have come to light in the last 20 years. Uh, in addition to that, Jim is also a stratigrapher, and he is redefining not only the Cedar Mountain Formation throughout Utah and other surrounding areas, um, he's a world expert on the Morrison Formation, and has been busy uh, changing some of the members and lateral facies changes within the Morrison Formation as well. And with that, uh, Jim has probably 15 different projects that he would love to have somebody come and do a master's project on. So I encourage you to contact him if that's something you're interested in. Oh. Okay. <laughs>